Hello, we're back attacking the other side. might is there something to talk about of course there's something to talk about because <laughs> that was D and D we played yesterday and you will never believe what I'm going to tell you you're never going to guess who the DM was I give you it it wasn't me it wasn't anybody you don't know it was mr. plain old Quentin he did his first session as a DM. But since the other guys are not as good in English as we are, we decided on hey, I know Quentin's biggest story is going to be in English, but this one is German now. Thus, uh, yeah. It was German, and uh, Quentin couldn't really like flex his role-playing muscles does yeah it was it wasn't half that bad but it also wasn't half that good it was just half that half you know what I'm getting at I know if Quentin will ever be back on his channel explain to you what he did in his fucking session I don't really think so but I don't Maybe I'll give you a little bit of a what happened. So let's go down the characters. I played a Shutter Kai. So like elves but from the from Shadowfell. Who are uh, whose goddess are is the Raven Queen. Thus I have a very close connection to death, which is kind of a theme for all of my characters because I'm very bad in D&D and always the fucking boy. So yeah. Uh, he had lots of necromancy spells. How much does this do? It does more damage and heals us. We keep on doing that. Uh, he did a lot of necromancy. Yeah, he was more of a support character. Uh, class was cleric. Uh, grave domain subclass. It was a 2024 cleric, even though I don't really know what differences that will make. But he was. His motives were just to fill the things the Raven Queen say to us, which would basically be um, go ahead and catch the dreams and the memories of the people that have died. It was kind of creepy with the dead. I don't know. I just when I killed someone, licked the dagger. I had like <laughs> just when I mentioned the dagger, you would obviously think that uh, somebody like that would have. I don't know, maybe mace and a shield, which he did. And I think I hit with the mace the entire game, not once. So yeah, I had a dagger. I bought a dagger in the beginning of the game. It was a little bit better. It kind of had the champions, the battle champion uh, fighter mechanics. So when I roll 19 or 20, I would gain... I will, I will call that as a, also as a quit. Do I was about that? Then 
other people, other characters. Let's call the other guy Mr. D. Uh, uh, how, how, uh, okay, let's just call the character. Um, then we had a character which clearly wasn't based upon Luci uh, Lucifer Morningstar. Never would have been based around that, especially not with his name called Lucius Star. I'm not going to judge, but I have judged him. And he and I were sort of the uh, uh, nagging each other all the time characters. That's what we did. He was a bard, but he didn't sing, he just was like, yeah, I'm going to play that now role, and then he played it, quote unquote. <laughs> Fucking boring! But yeah, what can you do? Nothing. It was about his character, I didn't know what his motives really were. He was just like playing a like, certain guy from a certain TV series. It would. That was basically everything he did. Then we had. a uh, ranger. With the gun feed, I don't know how it's called, gunslinger, gun something something. So he had a fucking musket with the misfire feature, and yeah, he just tried to play around that. He was. Wait a second. <laughs> yeah, he was a soldier. Played in a few wars. Fought in a few wars and played. Then uh, went to dwarves to build a musket with them, him together. So that's basically it. Let's go full on risk. It will do nothing. I know that. Exactly. Oh yeah, it was his character. He was old. A veteran, you could say. He's out of range for someone that's the exact same thing. And he was the group that. Which I don't know why you wouldn't imagine that he already would be if he would be the oldest one. It's not by effort. They were effort to buy, I don't remember. I thought it was just. playing what it was or something. But I wanted. So yeah, then uh, our group, we already knew each other, and we started in a tavern. In this tavern. We, uh, couldn't try to make, like, explain everything, and we were like, okay, so there are people. There's the guy who was bringing us the beer, but Quint really couldn't, like, bring out words that are above, um, Oh yeah, right, we have to move in. But I totally forgot. Well, I just did the same thing like a second ago. It was Dave, alright. Now he's dead. So we met in a tavern, uh, have been told that there's a ruckus going on on the western side 
of the city to the forest, so we're like, okay, I guess we need to go there to collect a nice little bit of money. Then we walked there, I was like, is there something else in the city? Like, uh, uh, a smith where you can buy weapons or potion shop or something. Yeah, there was a smith, and I was like, oh, sure. I will go there and got the dagger I was talking about, like, with two daggers so I can, like, do two attacks. I got that and everybody already complained. I, did you just spawn your really sick? It should be everything that you want. I was like, yeah, okay then. Then I won't go to the potion shop and probably buy a potion that would be beneficial to us later this game. Fucker's dead. Then we walked ahead, got to the western side, and we're like, hey, you know, let's go to the forest. There are fiends coming from that. I'm like, okay, sure. We walk in there. The other guys were more a little bit uh, stealth, stealthy, like walking next to the magician. We got uh, everything sorted for us, and I was like, I just started rambling about what an idiot he is and that this plan won't work and everything. Alright. Blitzer knows. When you got the ball, you gotta score! A day with you is never dull. Hey! Star players first! Dream on? Dream on? Dream on! Oh, I was prepared for falling. I would like to heal. May I? Guess not. Don't do damage immediately. I dare you. All right. Twenty bucks. It won't work. Fuck. Um, yeah. We went there, I was like, yeah, we're good. And we went into the forest with all the others. With an army of a thousand men. <laughs> uh, who is an elixir? No. We got... No. Fuck. Lulu's useless?
Um, yeah, and we went in there, and we noticed that we're enemies running towards us. Thus, our group went ahead and uh, tried to make themselves not be as in the way, like hide, duck, something. I climbed up a tree. Yeah, good guest. 108. How much did Walker do? Not that much. The gunner already made a deal with the boss, the others, or well, like not the boss, but uh, the sorcerer who uh, was with us. That we uh, get paid for every monster we kill. So he was like, "Okay, there are a few running away. So let let last few. Let's just try to shoot one of them to already get a few money in the a little bit of money in the bag." So, uh, they did that. We did that. To be honest. Um, he shot one. I was, uh, going to help him. Couldn't really do shit. Because I couldn't hit anything. I was too far away. Okay, he's out of range. So yeah, then we started fighting a little. Not really much interesting shit happened. Then we... Oh. Went ahead and... Uh, followed what the... Um, magician suggested. I don't know if he was a sorcerer or a magician, I'm perfectly honest. Wow! Or fucking summon! Wow. Um... Yeah, followed them through a forest, and the forest they were like bomb plants, like Zelda, but they had more AOE and they had a poison. Oh yes, something did happen. I got attacked by one of those uh, more enemies coming towards us, and I um, I do Constitution save to not be petrified. I don't know why I, I failed it, obviously. I wasn't petrified just yet, it was like climbing up, so I had to do a petrified throw each time. But then we killed it, and I did a petrified throw. Petrified pie, bro. 
Grin was like, how about you just petrified fill above your egg? I'm like, so I cannot walk really. He was like, yes, your walking speed limit is five. So yeah, that was how far I could walk. Which was very, very, very unfortunate. So, um, Mr. Morningstar, not called Morningstar, but I would call him Morningstar, had to carry me the entire way. <laughs> so that was also a little funny tidbit. You're summon! You do more damage than you fucking heal. Yeah, we went the hell posted bomby flowers. Those bomby flowers had one big problem. Uh, none, sorry. And we went ahead and then we're like up to a temple thingy where the master of our magician was living. Or he used to live. He was just an apprentice. We were like, oh yeah, then we need to go probably in there because the source why the monster are coming is probably in there. So, okay, then he was like, yeah, I gotta use magic on this orb to open it, but uh, and waves of enemies will come and you have to defend me. He didn't use Trevia yet. This is probably the uh, group of it high now. But, um, but then there came monsters like there were gargoyles up ahead. They're gonna try to shove like a gun. To their mouth, uh, again, his uh, two short swords into their mouth so they would like start to move, like maybe uh, hurt themselves. They both just spit it out. We were fighting against the gargoyles. I was uh, with my five feet walking radius, I was just positioned immediately next to uh, the sorcerer Marvin. So yeah, I tried to defend him, got all my shield and a dagger. And my strat now was shield, dagger, spiritual weapon, which is not bound to concentration, and also vampiric touch. The vampiric touch. Like, I didn't miss any concentration throws on that. Saved my fucking ass to heal me and also do loads of damage. It was amazing. But, I still managed to fucking die. Like, I was like, okay, I need to pee. Okay, let's make this quick and everything. Then, um... I got... Uh, yeah, so I did loads of damage to... Oh, no. We killed the uh, gargoyles. But then a mount, oh, I don't know how Quinn called it, came. It was literally like Swamp Thing. So that thing came. It hasn't killed me yet, but we killed the first one. I got it down to like 1 HP because my combination didn't really work. I didn't really figure it out before I started playing this character. I was just like, okay, we do that now.
Oh yeah, there we I had to kill the one, then he got shot. Or if we were dead, it was just a new mount coming that was already there. Which I made loads of damage to, but it was enough to kill me beforehand. Which is unfortunate, but... Uh, fuck. It can happen. Sometimes it happens, so it can happen. Alright. Yeah. Then I was, uh, while I was... While I die, while I fell down, I had to do the dexterity save. Decide which direction I have. I have fall. So I fucked that up, fell into the monster, which then started to entangle me. Then I was like, okay, I'll take a piss. While I was taking a piss, they went ahead and killed me. I still have darkness. I'm an idiot. This could have been gone. Yes. Still do it sooner. Yes. We won't make it. Yeah, then I came back, they killed it, I got re revived, and I was like, hey, you know if this would have been the other way around, and... Fuck, it's the big one. And if you guys would have died, I could have done loads of things. Loads! Yeah. But that didn't happen. So... Yeah. Just oh yeah, Graveyard doesn't kill. I forgot. Like Final Fantasy, uh... 7. We had to spell. Never really worked. Just thought it ain't dead. But it is. Alright, that's good. Already charged, I got it. It doesn't kill! I forgot. Uh you take damage now. Concentrate. Concentrate. So yeah, then I came back and uh, I was like, okay, why don't we just, you know, maybe go ahead and um, do a little short rest. I am technically an elf, but I just need four hours. We were like, oh yeah, yeah, that is smart, that is smart. What I would have said if Mr. Lucius wasn't like, I oh, will go ahead, I will walk ahead. So Mr. Gunn and I stayed back, I was like, okay, I'm going to just lay down now and take a fucking nap. Uh, 
we went ahead and did all the story things of like getting the thing that monsters probably were afraid of running away from. We got it away, it was a big gem. Carried it away, came to us. It was like only one hour has passed. Thus. We were a little bit uh, overwhelmed. Anyway, so then he came back and like woke me and I was like, okay, I'll have to take it on a short rest, so I forced me to use the hit dice to like fully recover. I only had 4 HP missing, but I had to use 2. Oh uh, yeah. Carried the thing back. Um, I was being carried by Lucius again. Our gunner carried the gem. And we walked away, and uh, yeah, nothing really happened. Until they were like, there are to go something. They were like Minotaurs, but more human and more metallic. And nobody of us has equipped heat metal, which would have been super nice now. So then we were like, okay, running, running, running. We ran past the bomb flowers again and was like, okay. So while they're running through, we're gonna shoot back. And then we're like, I don't know if they got damaged. But they apparently didn't die from it, even though the DM specifically specified, specified that uh, even if you're immune to uh, poison, it still would hurt you. I wasn't immune. But he probably meant me, because I had resistance against that. You know what, let's uh, play a little safe. And we walk back to the thingy, and yeah. Dead. Then we were still running. And Lucius was carrying me. Oh, he's dead. Uh, Lucius was carrying me. We ran out of the forest again into the thousands of soldiers that were waiting for us. He casts darkness to make sure that this thing doesn't cannot hit us and everything. So we were just running in the dark until we hit a wall. Head coup, 
Riku, Aklama! It's going to come back, isn't it? I know. What? You're kidding me! No, we have to beat the guy inside, Sin! The Crusaders would be out of a job if it was this easy, huh? But it has weakened. I'm sure of it. Yeah! We're winning! Alright, I'll do what I can with the main gun. Uh, I need stuff. This isn't over. Not yet. I know. May I? You got no fucking ether. Thank you. you. Well, you're fucking kidding me, right? Thank you. You're. Can I punch him? Sin still lives. We're counting on you, kid. Sin is gone. Uh, this is I can remember the normal. Yeah, it. Where was a fucking merchant? No, with the Guardos that was. Here we go! Let's check that out. Why are you in Gordo Salam? What business have you here? You want to start something? Uh, if it would please you to harm a defenseless old man, then burn me, boil me, it matters not. Huh? Lord Seymour is gone. No lord rises to take his place. The Guardo merely wait for sin to come and finish us off. Why should I care what you do to me? Oh, oh. If it meant rejoining Lord Jiskel and Lord Seymour, then your taking off my head would be the greatest kindness. Do it. I just need potions, my dude. Come to kill the... Good. Only potions. Ether potions. Nobody fucking got anything. I have to remember where I fucking came from, which I cannot. Uh, where was I? Was the way you can press? Was the 
as well. No. Was it you? Yes. Uh, we ran back, hit the wall, then started to fight against them. They obviously killed all the humans after each other, like nobody's You're business. Give me a second, I'm going to Google now where I can buy stuff. Not going to figure out. Nobody drops them. Alrighty. Yeah, here we go. I just fall combat. We always fought soon. I rotate my camera. Um, where do we need to go? Man, we must have hit that thing enough by now. I think it's a little early to start celebrating. Pops Machina always seem to break when you need... Mm. We're counting. Yeah, then we thought that uh, Lucius uh, ran away, away, uh, like, further, further, without carrying me. Like, after we hit the wall, he was just ran away to the tavern and drank beer. I was like, okay. Uh, I'm with Yuna. Like, hey, DM, how about, uh... I go, uh... That's my deity, the Raven Queen, teleported. One of the monster because they had to teleport left. I wonder if Sir Jack is in pain. Let's just end this quickly. The Faith said they'd help us, right? It bothers me the way they said that. Huh? I mean, they've been fighting alongside us this whole time, but now they say they'll help? I guess so. Wait. Sin is reborn when Yu Yevon merges with an Aeon. Isn't that right? If I summon an Aeon, Yu Yevon will join with it. But at first, it'll be small, won't it? Yeah. Then we might be able to beat it without the final summoning. I don't know. What if Yu Yevon jumps again? Then we'll take it down again. We'll fight him until there's no place left to run. Uh. I never thought it would come down to this. Yeah, I know. Hey, the Faith, they're tired of this whole thing too. Let's let them rest. The Faith said it's pointless to keep dreaming. The dream will disappear. He said. What did he mean? And what is it that you, Yevon, is summoning from within sin? The dream of the faith. You won't go away, will you?
He's waiting for you. Well, son, the main gun is still busted. We can't give you any cover fire. Hey, just take us in. We'll do the rest. All right. Take us up, flush to the mouth! No mistakes, or I'm gonna tear out that mop you call hair! Uh, trust me. Me, take you there. Uh, no problem, yeah? Let's get ready to blitz! Our father's wishes, let's make them come true. Come true in the next one.